like it, it is History Month here on People of the East. Of course, I welcome you once again. Today is the 20th day of January, the year of our Lord, 2021, and the time standing at 12 minutes past 11 in the morning. So I want to welcome you wherever you are, wherever you are hearing the sound of my voice this morning. It is a warm good morning from me, Mazu Kechuku Onoha. Like I said, it is a history month, and of course, we are trying to assist our people in remembering our history, in remembering who we are. Therefore, we are giving out prizes this morning. We are going to ask a very simple question. Of course, if you get the question, you will be privileged to get the smart watering prize from us. And we have actually made this question very easy and very, very easy. I can tell you, on Monday, it was a bit difficult. But this morning, I've rolled it over and asked the same question again. Now, listen to what I'm asking in a very simple time. I'm asking you, the first shot of the Nigerian Civil War, of course, which was fired in 1967, everybody knows that. I want to know, on which date and which month? Of course, you tell me the date of that month and, of course, where it was fired. Where was the first shot fired? Where was the first shot fired during the Nigerian Bia France Civil War of 1967? And I'm asking you, what month did it happen and what is the date? Of course, where? was it fired now this is very simple as it can get you know last time we asked you that uh, where it was fired the local government we also ask you the province of course and we ask you the date the month that was so much but this morning i'm asking a very simple question what date of the month was it how did it happen of course you tell me the date and the month and of course where it happened where was the first shot of the civil war fire that is all i'm asking this morning and that is all i need to know if you call and you get it correct trust me when i tell you you will walk away with a prize right now for us to go straight to this i need to give you the numbers to call you need to know what numbers to call and that is very very important so let me give out the numbers as soon as i give you these numbers then i will open our lines straight away if you want to call us this morning and also don't forget that this uh, competition is also limited to those who are in biafra land of course if you want to answer you are calling from germany wherever you can answer it is fine but don't forget it is only those in biafra land that are going to win this prize because we're doing this competition as well to assist our people who are in biafra land you know maybe get them some data for their phone so that they can afford or they can be able to listen to radio biafra as well as go to the uh, social medias you know to proclaim about biafra so call us on plus two seven six three two seven two one two double five this is our main line let me give it to you again plus two seven six three two seven two one two double five for the last time our main line and which is the line that you are going to call us this morning is plus two seven six three two seven two one two double five then if you want to call us on whatsapp we are also on whatsapp and our whatsapp number is as follows plus two seven seven four zero six seven eight four one two plus two seven seven four zero six seven eight four one two for the last time our whatsapp number plus two seven seven four zero six seven eight four one two or you can call us on skype because radio biafra sadek people of the east we are on skype and our skype id is radio biafra sadek radio biafra is one word radio biafra sadek radio biafra sadek that is our what do you call it is our skype id all right let me go straight to announcement because we have fasting and prayer coming up at the end of this month let us give you that announcement while we wait for calls to start trooping in while we wait for calls to start trooping in don't forget the question where was the first shot of the nigerian Biafran civil war fired which town date and month that's all i'm asking where was it fired what is the name of 
the place where the first shot of the civil war fired what is the date and what is the month and you can call us on all those platforms that i've given to you what's up uh, can you hear me hello yes loud hello. and clear go ahead yeah. Nazi. my name is elijah nguruma i hear from a boy state but i resign in italy they will. so the 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 Nigerian war started since the uh, war started the sixth of July, nineteen sixty seven, at Obudu. The first shot that Nigeria shot on Biafra was nineteen sixty one. Mm, was in Obudu, Ogoja province, Biafra land. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you very much, Mazi, for your answer. But of course, that is not the answer I'm looking for. Obviously, this competition, like I said, is for those who are in Biafra land. But thank you for trying. Okay. There were. Okay. All right. Thank you, my brother. Let's go to the line. Call on the line. Are you there? Can you hear me? Call on the line. Hello? Yes, good morning from here. Hello? Go ahead, uh, Mazi. We can one. hear you loud and clear. Uh, I'm Go ahead. I'm calling from it. Yes. yes, go ahead, Mazi. So the first shot was shot at River State, River State, the Afaran, on 6th July 1967 by 5.30 a.m. Yes, where? Where? You say it's in River, like where? Where is the town? Do you know the town? All right, I'm actually looking for the date and the town. The date and the town, that is what I'm looking for. Where was the first shot fire? Do you know the date? Do you know the month? Do you know, of course, the town? Call on the line, can you hear me? Call on the line. Yes, Mazi, go ahead. Good morning. That line is that line is not holding. That line is not holding, Mazi. Unfortunately, I know it is not holding. It's just a matter of time before it goes off. All right, we must continue. It is still Radio Biafra Sadek. We are the people of the East. If you know the answer, please give us a call. Join the interaction now. What are you waiting for? Call her on WhatsApp. Can you hear me? Good morning. Good morning. Please turn down your radio, Mazi. Turn down your radio. Very, very important. Hello, good morning. Yes. Turn down your good radio morning, or walk good away morning, from it. Mazi, I have you? done it. I have done it. I have done it. This is Chide I am calling you from River State. All right, go ahead. I am calling you from River State. Go ahead. The first shot was fired in, in the, on the 6th of July, 1967. At Gakem Bekwara local government in Cross River State. All right, Mazi, thank you for your answer. Of course, you have to keep listening and see if you are the winner or not. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mazi. All right, thank you very much. Of course, we must continue. We are still taking your call. If you know the answer, please call us until we get the correct answer. Caller on the line, can you hear Hello? me? Yes, Mazi, go ahead. Hello? Go ahead. Yes, I'm Obodo Chukwuka. Thanks for many witnesses. Yes. The first shot was, was shot at River State. There was. There was local government. River State. You said it was shot in River State. You, are, you just gave me a town. You have not given me the date and the month. Maz, are you still there? All right, he cannot hear me. I am looking for the date and the month as well as the town where it happened. Of course, we must continue. If you call in, you answer. Of course, you wait for us at the end of the show when we are going to announce the winner and see if you got it right this morning. People are on fire. My goodness me, they won this prize by all means. And of course, you never know who's the lucky person this morning. Call her on WhatsApp. Can you hear me, people of the East? Call her on WhatsApp. Are you still there? Good morning. 
All right, caller on WhatsApp somehow cannot hear me. I don't know why that is the case, but of course we must continue. Let's go to the next caller on WhatsApp. Caller on WhatsApp, can you hear me? Good morning. Uh, good morning. Uh, good morning. My name is um, Kenzie Progress. I'm from Worry. All right, Mazi, please go ahead and welcome to the program. Oh, thank you. Um, according to the question you asked, the answer is um, since July 1997 in um, uh, uh, Darton Town in um, St. Cross River State. All right. Thank you very much for your answer, Mazi. Keep listening. And of course, at the end of the show, you will see whether you are the winner or not. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. <laughs> I just got a, a shock right now, a very big shock. This person that called now on uh, WhatsApp, you know, when you, I, I saw his, uh, you know, his status, his screen saver when he called. <laughs> I thought it was me. <laughs> he looks just like me. I'm telling you 100% like me. I just got a shock. I'm like, what is my picture doing on this person's screen saver? But I look, it's somebody else who look 100% like me. Amazing how people resemble each other. That. My goodness me. All right, we must continue. It is still Radio Biafra Sadek. We are the people of the East. Join the interaction now. Call on the line. Can you hear me? Good morning, people of the East. Hello, good morning, sir. Please go ahead. My name is Dr. Clement. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm calling from Delta. Yes, go ahead, Marzi. The first shot was fired at the... Uh, that uh, on the fifth of July, nineteen fifty-seven. All right. Thank you, Mazi, for your answer. Yeah. Like I said, keep listening and see if you are the winner. Thank you very much. All right, of course, he have answered his own. Like I said, we try to make this thing as easy as possible. Everybody is trying their best. But hey, who knows who's going to be the you know, winner? And of course, I know people have also made a bit of a research. Whether their research is the right one or not, we don't know. But we are going to know at the end of this program. All right, we must continue. And we are taking your calls this morning. Of course, if you know the answer, hit me up this morning with your answer. Let's see if you know your history. Good morning. Good morning, my brother. And welcome to People of the East. Yes, I'm calling from Enugu State, Biafra Land. Please go ahead. Uh, the first shot was shot at Bekwa, local government, River State, on 16th July 1967 by a Nigerian army that, that launched an artillery attack on Biafra's army camp on the hill. All right. Thank you very much for your answer. Mazi, keep listening. You could be the Thanks. winner. Thank you. Let me tell you time, 5.30 a.m. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much. All right. You know one thing about answering questions, sometimes you will get some part correct, sometimes you will get some part wrong. That is the thing. But of course, like I said, we will know the person that got it right on the dots. And of course, after today going forward, each day we ask a question. If we don't get the correct answer, of course, we will kill that question after we have told you the answer. And then the next time we move on to the new one. The reason why we rule this one over from Monday to today is an exception because of the complete complete complications in in that question it's a very very technical question you know the way i ask it i wanted uh, about five answers in one question so we decide to make it easy and possible because we want to we want you to win we want to give the praise to you it's the right thing to do so we must continue this morning uh, let me see let me see caller on the line if you can hear me good morning good morning sir please go ahead this is, this is so much to from uh, Delta State. All right, Mazin Dewo, please go ahead. What is your answer? Okay. The first shot was fired uh, uh, in uh, 1967, 6th, 6th July, in uh, in uh, Gakam, Etam, 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 in uh, the, the far local government area of France. All right. 
Thank you very much for your answer. Thank you for your answer, Mazi. We have noted that. Please keep listening at the end of the program. You will know if you got it right. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. All right, we must continue. I don't know what is happening here. It's like Unubugespo here, Onyola. You know, Onyazawane has a answer. It's like people are listening for what other people are answering, and then they will answer. They don't even know whether that what that person is answering is the right answer or is the wrong <laughs> answer. And you know, this is what we call let us fail together or let us pass together. But we will know. We will find out at the end of the day which is which, which is the correct answer. It is still Radio Biafra Sadek. This is People of the East. And we are coming to you live and direct all the way from Johannesburg, the city of gold. All right. Call out on WhatsApp if you can hear me. Good morning. I know I have somebody on WhatsApp. Please, if you can hear me, talk to me. I need you to talk to me. Call out on WhatsApp. All right, not to be, unfortunately, he cannot hear me. You know the problem with WhatsApp, of course, sometimes it is through uh, buffering, sometimes it's actually uh, on, on the dots, but we don't know why this person is not hearing me on WhatsApp. I can hear you. I there we go. You. All right, good morning, and welcome to the program. Good morning, sir. All right. Yeah, please. My name is Charles, and the answer is, 90, the war started in 6th of July, 1967. And, and the, the first shots of fire that Enugu. Where are you calling from, uh, sir? I'm calling from London. Sorry, man. You already you already disqualified from <laughs> because you are in diaspora. <laughs> thank you, <laughs> thank, thank you very much. <laughs> thank you for trying. You already disqualified because we need people like you. We need people like you to sponsor the competition so that we can better the life of our people in Biafra land. That's what we need people okay, from diaspora to do. Thank you very much. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> no much okay. All right, we must continue. I don't think what uh, is it. What exactly is it that uh, we can do for people in the diaspora in terms of this competition? There's nothing we can do for them. Rather, they are the ones who will do something for our people back home. We need to encourage them now and then. That is what we need to do. So if you are in diaspora and you want to help our people back home, you want to sponsor this competition, please drop me a message in my inbox. Mike Biafra OB, Mike Biafra OB, M I K E, Mike Biafra OB O B I. Oh, that is my Skype ID. I mean, sorry, that is my Facebook ID. <clears throat> so you can drop me a message on Mike Biafra OB, and of course, we can tell you what you need to do mike biafra ob we are doing this competition in two ways we are doing it because we want to educate our people in terms of our history secondly also we want to use it to give a token to our people in biafra land maybe a recharge card voucher which the person can convert into data to assist our people to listen to radio biafra as well as go online to propagate this gospel according to the restoration of biafra and that is why we are asking in this very simple question so if you are in diaspora don't call me to tell me the answer rather call me to tell me what you can do or how you can help or how you can assist call her on whatsapp can you hear me yes call her on whatsapp can you hear me WhatsApp takes a bit of a time because of the network issues, but eventually it does connect. I've connected this person on WhatsApp, but unfortunately he is not hearing me yet, but I know he will hear me later. So call her on WhatsApp. If you can hear me, please, good morning. And I want you to tell us your name and where you are calling from. All right. Unfortunately, so he cannot hear me and then we must continue this is radio biafra sadek and don't get it twisted we are the people of the east and of course we are live we are direct and chukwo kikabia ma ekekerowa onye promi henile he is presiding over the affairs of his This is Radio Piafra Sadek. Johannesburg is where you are. 
It looks like the person on WhatsApp can hear me. Come on, WhatsApp, can you hear me now? I can hear you, sir. All right, Mazi, please, please go ahead. Okay. Actually, I'm half uh, humble, Elijah. I'm on your. Mazi, I can hear something noise, some noise on the background. I don't know. That is too. Okay, in another him the cookie. Loud and clear. Please go ahead. Your name is please and where okay. you're calling from. Afamu Elijah Nguruma, Abmoni Yuko, Abakliki Post Runs, Biafra Land. All right, welcome to the program. Please go ahead. Yeah. I'm not Vienna, Apo. Um, Biafra will be the one ever now for Uputu, local government, and across river. So when I get with the Anupro, um, Oboja Provost, we cross river for another, uh, so I had it on the 6th of July, 1967. Can you tell me about the river? All right. Mazi, Mazi, you are calling from Austria, right? Yeah, I'm calling from Austria at the moment from Vienna. Thank you very much. So what we expect from you, who is in Austria, Vienna, is to help us sponsor this competition and not to call and answer oh. questions. <laughs> no problem. Right. I've added you on Facebook. I've added you. Mike will be the Afro. That's the one. The That's the one. Thank you very much. Yes. It won't cost you okay. anything. It won't cost you anything. Just a small token. So that anybody who calls from Biafra land and get it right, we'll get them some recharge card or recharge voucher so that they can be able to convert it into data and use it to listen to Radio Biafra. That's all. All right. No problem, sir. Thank you very much, my brother. Thanks, and we welcome that. We must continue this question, or rather, this competition is strictly for those who are in Biafra land. And they are the ones who are worthy to win the prize. So if you know you are in Biafra land, take a chance. You might be the winner. But if you are in diaspora, rather call us and tell us what you can do or how you can help. And we will explain to you how the competition works. You don't even need to give us money. We we don't need your money because we don't accept money here on people of the east rather we will tell you what to do as soon as somebody wins then you will probably be the one to send the voucher to the person by yourself for by yourself we are not going to get involved in any money transaction or money changing hand it is not what we do we don't do that we don't entertain that we just tell you listen here is the winner and this is what you must do and this is what, what the person have won and then you will do the needful but of course it is very simple just like that all right we must continue radio biafra it is i don't know who's this but let's see if we can get this all right i'm not supposed to take this call on this platform let me take it from this side unbelievable what have i done let me see i see um okay let me do it like this. Very, very important. We must continue. Of course, it is still Radio Biafra. Um, my goodness me. Please bear with me. There is some, a lot of complications here. All right, let's go. Caller on what's on the line. Can you hear me? Caller on what's Okay, Okay. Maz, you okay for it? Hold on, I will come to you. I think I have another right. caller there, please. If you can hear me, talk to me. Okay. All right. There's a bit of a mess up here, and I need to correct it right now. Let me correct it. Yeah, Maz, okay for it? Just hold on. There is a bit of a mess up here, and I'm trying to sort it out. Very, very important. And then, of course, there we go. Let me do this right away. Um, on money, how technology it is not as easy like that, but of course, I is may we are be our friends, we know it all. All right, let's go. Caller on WhatsApp, can you hear me? Caller on WhatsApp, Caller, yes, good morning. Caller on WhatsApp, please go ahead. Good morning, they want you naked, please go ahead. Go ahead, caller on WhatsApp. 
Hello. Good morning. Yes, good morning, Marzi. Good I can morning. hear you loud and clear. Go ahead. Unbelievable. Unfortunately, he cannot hear me. It is of a bit of an issue here with the lines, but we must continue. Caller on the line, are you still there? Can you hear me? Caller on the line. Caller on the line, are you still there? Can you hear me? Unbelievable. All right, all right. We are uh, getting it sorted. Caller on WhatsApp. This is not WhatsApp. Let's see. WhatsApp, can you hear me? Caller on WhatsApp. Hello, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you, Marzi. Over and over, I can, can hear, hear you. All right, you are the one who cannot hear me. I don't know why. Can you hear me, Marzi? I'm hearing you. Go ahead if you can hear me, Marzi. I'm hearing you. Then go ahead. Go ahead. On WhatsApp, I'm calling. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> We are still waiting for you, Marzi, to yes, go ahead. Yes, I can hear you. Good morning. Mazike, good morning, Agulamo. <laughs> go ahead, My name. please. Yes. I'm hearing you very clear. Unbelievable. I'm hearing you clear. Then speak to me, Mazi, if you're hearing me. Uh, speak to me. Yes, go ahead. I'm educate Oleru. Mazi educate Oleru. Can you hear me? All right, let's leave it, Mazi. That is not what we are going to be doing here. Can you hear me? Can I hear you? Unbelievable. Caller on Skype, are you there? Can you hear me? Caller on Skype. Mazi, okay, go ahead. Yeah. Please go yeah, ahead. My beloved Good morning from Warsaw, Poland here. They will. Uh, appreciate you. And uh, I greet my beloved sons, my brothers, uh, all my name. We are forcing it we are forcing it on them because that is who they are. We are forcing it down their truth. They have no choice. Because you see because I don't want I am a good one. I am a good one. I am a good and all his listeners, being the need for the DOS, all of them, fanatical Biafrans, radical Biafrans, men of valor, defending your motherland. I appreciate all of you. And I think I will key in because the, the source of this program is my brother, Simon. I am no work. I am no work. Absolutely. I will talk to him. Absolutely. Well, when I drop, we see what we can do. I just call to say I'm in, okay? Thank you, very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. My own job in Ongana, Pian Bamba. On a little bit of money here, Megan here, I tell you, Bamba. Yotala. I have a man. I am a well. I believe you on you. Thank you very much. Yes, yes. All right, for goodness sake, of course, some are called, of course, to broadcast on the radio. Some are called, of course, to broadcast where you are in the marketplace. Some are called to be coordinators. Some are called, of course, to be national and, of course, uh, regional and as well as reps all around the Afra. Some are called to be everything. Wherever you find yourself in this struggle, trust me when I tell you, you have your own work to do. Stay on your lane. I stay on my lane. Don't leave your lane and jump on my lane. Because each one poor from lane to get to another person's lane. My goodness me, when they get one accident, that's how accidents happen. When you leave your lane, you jump onto somebody's lane without any indicator. You know, people who built the car, they built the car and they also added indicator, navigator. When you indicate left, then of course the person who is already on the left lane who have a right of way we know that the guy who is indicating from left want to join the lane he can slow down and allow you to join but when you just enter without any indication one my piagiri my piagiri and when traffic cops come they will know that you are the one at fault because you did not do what indicate so you may get it now on the highway 
There are fast cars. There are slow cars. And when a Porsche, one day when a Lamborghini, and when a Bugatti, and when all one on the highway. Now, that is why those who built the road, they are not stupid. Some roads have three lanes. Some roads have four lanes. In America, I know their lanes is up to six, self because it is a mega country. But in major towns of the world, there are lanes, four lanes, three lanes, five lanes, and what have you. There is a reason why they built five lanes. Let me tell you why they built five lanes. They understand. And you have to do what? Stay on the slow lane. And any cars that can do only 120 km per hour, they stay on the second lane. There are cars who can do 130, 150, 180. They stay on the third lane. There are cars that flies, my goodness me. They can do 200 Ks. They can do 220 and they can stay on the speed lane. Ha ne Ferrari ha Porsche no money ha. Or quarter ke lesson on Range Rover. Ha no run again speed lane ne make ne fe fe. BMW e buruke ya bia. Ha ne fe na that speed lane. Then if your car spoil, you don't need to be on the road. Get park here one side on the what service lane. That service lane also is created for what ambulance, emergency cars, emergency services. They have the what that uh, service lane, which they draw yellow. We call it yellow lane. Don't overlap. Don't overtake without indicator. If you overlap and you overtake without indicator, one day, the person who have right of way megini apiagiri. The same thing is applicable in this struggle that we are in. Stay on your lane. We all complete each other. We all complete each other. As I'm on air right now, la piambamba, they preach this gospel without throwing any punches. So is a coordinator in his zone coordinating the people. So are the members of IPOB in that family bringing out their money. They bring out their money to do what's possible, what we are doing because this gospel runs on the wheels of money without money we cannot be able to feed our esn men on ground without money we cannot be able to feed those widows those orphans whom their people have died because of this gospel one name again stay on your lane let me stay on my lane any day you leave your lane you enter my lane it's as simple as that all right we must continue let us go to the lines. The lines are on. My goodness me. It's like I'm in the spirit here. I pega here, umbamba. When I am a kwachi, I am a hachi. I can only get a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little this is here we are. This is who we are. We are whiter than white. We are whiter than truth. I am able to choose you. Quaka, get called a bitch. You want to get a guy here. I chop one again. One name. Get on a social media. You talk rubbish for one week, one month. After one week, one month, you will become irrelevant. Most of us don't understand that what makes us to be who we are. What makes us people listen to us? Look at me now. I'm Maziki Chukwanoha. Yes, I, I don't care. I'm going to brag. I am famous because of what I have done so far because I am somehow famous because of Radio Biafra. I am famous because of IPOB. I am famous because of this platform. Any day I talk rubbish, trust me when I tell you. And this microphone is taken away from me. I can go to Facebook and do Facebook Live. One day, two days, one month, three months. After three months, one day you become irrelevant. If anybody tell you that DJ Rez Huchemen for today, of course, will be irrelevant. Would you believe it? If somebody like him can become relevant because who are you? I'm talking about second in command, the former second in command. We can't afford a broken vehicle to remain on the main line. I know the speed, the 220. So he break it down. I have park here one side and service lane. What la? Like I have bugger again. Now that main lane, now Chine can we go slow? We traffic and I have to traffic. I have to go slow. Oh, they are all saying so. They are all saying so. And we are rushing. A bike that you are going to land. This person have interrupted me. 
I am in the spirit. I am in the spirit. I am in the spirit. But let me take this call. Mazi, good morning. Mazi, good morning. Yes. Mazi. Mazi, I am Mazi. in the spirit. I am in the spirit. And you just interrupted the spirit, but that you are is, forgiven. You are that forgiven. Is why, that is that is that is why I called to quench the fire before <laughs> the studio because i need to i need to uh, kind of uh, bring it down you know um i'm trying to remove my clothes no i'm trying to remove my clothes I can't even see who I'm fighting with here. But I'll come look at here with spiritual warfare. See. Spiritual warfare. If you don't like I, it, go on. I can see. And the, I don't know if you understand what I, I said, Marzi. I said, stay on yes. your lane. Let me stay on my lane. We complete each other. Don't overlap. Don't overtake without indicator. There's a reason why they put indicator yes. in every car. If you indicate on the highway, with, if you did not indicate, I beg your pardon, on the highway, and you join another lane, one night, Piagiri. Yes. Please go ahead. Exactly. Exactly. Because even in the spiritual realm, there, there is what they call division of labor. And uh, if you jump your uh, kind of uh, divisions and your departments to another man's uh, department, uh, it will coll collude in, uh, in terms of uh, Tiwa and Juma and uh, it will lead to a kind of destructions, you know, and um, at the end of it all, you will come out being disgraced, fully disgraced and frustrated, you know. So that is why it is better for anyone to do that which you know how to do best, no matter who all else is God. Focus on your lane. Believe in that which you are doing and do it to the fullest and to your best knowledge. You know, so because you right now, I can never be like you. If I try to be like you, I will be crushed. And you can never be like any other person more than you yourself. You know, so there is one thing people don't even know. When those just like um, um, a married woman, people will be telling you, you are beautiful, you are this, you are that. But when you are single and searching, nobody was there to uh, kind of um, praise you. And if you are a foolish woman, you will adopt those praises. By the time they're done on you, they left you and you are divorced. You don't have a husband, you don't have any home, you don't have any shelter. All those of them that are praising you will run away. You won't see them anymore. You know, that is how life is. That is why everybody has to a kind of um, stick to your lane, you know, because uh, just like you use scar as an illustration, uh, control your speed lane, Avoid unnecessary accidents because when you do, life will be lost, dignity will be lost, respect will be lost, recognition will be lost, every memory will be lost, and your name will be wiped out from the Guinness Book of Records. And um, you find out that you have just Kwasiaka Chilokokako. It becomes an error, you know? So, Mazi, continue with Thank what you, you are doing. I yeah. just call to. Um, put more oil upon your head. No, you just came. You just, you just, no, Maz, you call to quench the fire. You just came with fire extinguisher. That is what, <laughs> that is, that is what I mean. I put oil, <laughs> you know, oil quenches fire and opens every rust key because anointing breaks every yoke. That's so, that's so, so. Take it easy. All right. Just take it easy because, um, Speed milk, all the milk that has been spilled has been spilled. There is no mechanism for every broken bottle. Bottle no halawa or wago. So thank you very much. Thank you very much, Pastor Chris. And of course, Pastor Chris thought that he has quenched the fire. My goodness me, I am just getting warmed up. I am just getting started. What was I saying? Stay on your lane. Make I stay on my lane. This is a struggle. And of course, we complete each other. In a struggle, everybody must break to play what they can do. Whatever you do makes sense in this struggle. Whatever little contribution you 
you bring on the table in this structure, my brother, it makes sense. But what you must not do is to overlap. What you must not do is to leave your lane and jump into another lane. Unannounced. How do you announce your overtake? You announce your overtake through indicator. What is an indicator? Let me tell you what is an indicator. Now, we are in IPOB family. You already have a coordinator and you felt that your coordinator is not doing it well. Then you decide to plan a coup. You decide to organize your own cabal in your home, in your IPOB home cell. That is overtaking without what? Indicator. And once you try to do that, my brother, you will be destroyed. You will find yourself out in the cold because coups are not allowed. Cabals are not allowed. But if you use indicators, if you use indicator, trust me before you know it, you might even overtake your coordinator. How do I mean? If you use an indicator, which is do your work very well, do your work very efficiently. That's your coordinator whom you think he's not doing it well. He's not going to be a coordinator forever. Maybe the powers that be will see you from afar that you are using indicator, that you are doing it very well. The next thing you know, your name is announced on the radio that from today onwards that you are the new coordinator. That is what I mean by applying indicator. But without that, if you try to overtake, if you try to plan a coup, organize a cabal, my brother, you will be crushed. What am I saying? When number two, when number two wants to be number one without indicator, he is trying to overtake without indicator. If you say the Mazen Nam the Kanu is not doing it well, okay, no problem. We agree. But what have you done to show us that you can do better than him? Now, the indicator is you telling us what my and Nam the Kano is not doing well that you can do better. Now, once we see it, we can say, okay, let's vote on this. Who is for this man? Who is from our leader? Then we know who can do better. You cannot just jump out from nowhere like a headless chicken. You begin to overtake on the highway. My goodness me. My brother, that's what I'm trying to tell you this morning. Many people tried it. During the Civil War, there are so much saboteurs, even if Arjuna, if Arjuna tried to overtake without indicator. He tried to overtake Ujuku without indicator. And today he has become a statistics. We talk about him in a bad notation. Stay on your lane. Let me stay on my lane. We complete each other. This is a struggle. Alright, let's go back to the line because it is getting hot, hotter and hotter in the studio. And we need to apply break before Mother Megan walk here. Alright, call on WhatsApp. Can you hear me? People of the East, good morning. Yes, I can. I can hear you. Good morning, sir. Please go ahead, Marzi. Good morning from here. Okay. My name Ahambo uh EJK Oleru. Aumoya Imo State. Nabiafra land. Thank you very much. Makaiji before it's in uh, the the date and the place. That's right. Obu Obu in Cross River on the twentieth of uh, May nineteen sixty seven. Where do you say where do you say it is in Cross River? We are in uh, Obubu, Obubra, or what they call it, Obubra. <laughs> <laughs> All right, <laughs> go ahead, <laughs> go ahead. I'm listening, Mazi. Because I can't tell you any shiny honey, man. They will. She never gets you over because all that we work on, we don't have the car. We must be a fair opera. When I see that get doing it, guy, yanka. Thank you very much. Are you getting me? Loud and clear. How am I going to tell you how I'm 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 going to tell you
Jesus. You say, thank you very much, my brother. We get that and we'll listen and we we'll believe it. Of course, we must continue. It is to Radio Biafra Sadek. We are the people of the East. Coming almost or rather getting towards the end today. Let me go to Skype. I think I have a caller holding on Skype. Call on Skype if you can hear me. Good morning. Good morning, Mazike. Good morning from here. Good morning, Good morning and welcome to the program. Thank you very much. this morning touches all angle. All angle. That single word you said touches angle. But you know why the zoo is the zoo? And with express road, they, they never seen five lane before in their life, and so they can even somebody will be in the in the first lane taking the speed lane and block it. And the one you tell me, you will try to claim right and, uh, and they will lose their life there. And that is and that is how they works. So, what they, all, all they have said this morning, it happens in their life. But the, the Bible said, Woe to whom it passed through. This is second in command has already almost three months now. Uh, come on on radio telling us that he's not doing well but we're expecting him to tell us the right way to do it or move that straight point and go and do it so that we can see he has nothing to offer every day only to come to criticize is what they're doing in IPOB actually as you said there are people who want to overtake and some have tried to overtake not only in the second in command even at the local level they have tried to overtake and by the end they will flop because that's the that's the that's the essence of greediness. If you come inside you and you allow it to come, and you inside the human being, but if you allow it to take place in you, then at the end you'll be disgraced. There are people who are there. yeah, you are doing a job in the and somebody is envying you because you are doing it. But there are not people people are not gifted the same thing. People are, you can speak now eloquently on the radio. I may take that radio, I cannot speak, I should speak. There are people God give them the wisdom, the the talent to do whatever they are doing. Everybody ask a kero me, kero onye chuku onye. Ask na onye ni adi chile chana. Kanya ni kanya ni meno lelo wa ya bunke ya chuku chile poya. That is open ego. So a kero onye a kero. And the end the anila buko na onye ni onye onye adi chile chile chana. Kero pola chuku onye na giki gana mi na mi mama. So they go kasi na me today na ivi na mi of my pia mbamba. We tell these who kugi ni na. That you can see that people will try to come and do as you do. They can't do it. At the end, they can't do it. So there are people, even in IPOB, they want to be coordinator, they want to be in the national coordinator, or because they're taking power, they're doing whatever. At the end, they will be disgraced. And the worst thing to happen in man, to man is where he has built and been disgraced from where he has built or where he has supported to build. And if people expect you to be honest, at the end, they see you dishonest. You have killed yourself from ever, forever and ever. Nobody will regard you again. I'm not going to say anything. At the end, I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying anything. My brother, I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying anything. But I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying anything. That is all I have to say. My brother, I want the number you gave to me. Yeah, then I, it doesn't connect to WhatsApp, please. Is so how, how do I get that number? All right, I ha I still have I you. Know. I still have you on the messenger. I'm going to send you the number, or rather, I'm go or drop your own number, please. Drop yours and let me okay. rather uh, send you a message. All right. Okay. Okay. That's what I do. Chuko kika da magose jisika. We will call you very much. And therefore, we will be restored. Thank you very much. He said. He said. Thank you very much. All right. Of course, this morning the message is very simple. The message is direct. The message is very clear. My goodness me. Let me reiterate. Let me reiterate. There is a reason why those that came up with the road and the concept of the road and the car made lanes in the road because they understand that all hands are not equal all cars are not the same speed is not the same and where again the ferrari and where a porsche and where in bugatti and where my goodness me and where let them give them a push so many fast cars in this world we are in and there are very slow cars there are minimal cars and that's why they built the lanes so 
if you are fast enough, stay on the speed lane with him again. If you are minimal, stay on the other lane with him again. If you are slow, stay on the what? Slow lane. If your car spoil eventually on the highway, don't park on the highway. Rather park on the service lane. And if you want to overtake on all this lane, please indicate. When you indicate, the other driver will know that you what? Want to what? take over he will slow down for you and then you will move but if you did not indicate and you want to jump into another person's lane it will be disaster it will be accident it will be catastrophe in a game eh? the same thing is applicable in the struggle we are in stay on your lane do your own i do my own we complement each other at the end of the day biafra is what we want and we are going to get biafra when you are on your lane and i am on my lane because they don't like it all right we must continue of course i have a caller on skype let me go on skype caller on skype if you can hear me good morning good morning sir good morning man good morning watching a care watching a good one three go but i go away brother i dare you from port elizabeth here in south africa thank you very much i bless you to go the year mazi um hey we give you a platform. You think that you have arrived. As soon as you get out of this platform, we give you. It gives you so we get a yap, 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 yap. Within two, three months, we will get a money. Why don't our people learn lessons? What do you put in an accord? You use yourself as an example. That is honest truth. Anybody will keep going with you. In your own, when you are also of my heart, I will run. When you run very well, you do your competition very well. You are going to be rewarded. You took camera, you took out camera, my guy goes again. Undi na na gina, undi na na go kena wey na mega ga ga get togi. You know people around. What do you know? Keta na my brother. Emma, how far your phone na ring because people want to talk to you because you're doing a very good job. You know, but the man man has jumped for the university. Go get a journalist book or music or radio. Take go get a school. The way the medicine present, man, when when music get that, everything now by the no na ya na ya. You take go. So if you any kind of like this, na gas na, I wanna one one of the most super journalists. Before that, for Nigeria, I when I even when I program in a man before the airport and the matter from from Nigeria, I met a tele televising of a TNN man on a na by news and all those things. That's right. You're bringing so much light. You're bringing so much light and so much flowers, so much love. But I want to talk to one certain people. These certain people are dear friends. To be honest with you. I don't know how much this, how much this our message is going to the grassroots. Thank God for this competition. Maybe by next week or there about to mark up again. See, now you get me. No one came join. You must have seen you see bomb can you go or a charge a card? Because I want this message to go to the grassroots. Because our people are sometimes get us. Everybody wants something in the morning. Yeah, go shop. You go to shop. You go and sell. You come back home. That is all you think about. We are talking about Biafra. So many people are not going to come up even in Biafra land. What are you waiting for? Oh yeah, my car. Preach it in the market. Talk, I talk about it in the area, in the market. Everywhere you do, you ask, talk about Biafra restoration. Let all our mindset wake up to the reality of what is happening. Download the I, 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 community radio, or Biafra uh, 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 radio, or even radio on the way, 24-7, you'll be hearing what is happening. Because what happens in this struggle, it is something of the spirit. When the spirit possesses you, you cannot do otherwise. You are going to be on fire, just like Mars this morning. You are on fire because the spirit of the fire is on you and it's in so many of our people who has nothing else to do than to think, how can we restore the kingdom of God on earth? I will thank my leader, Mars Nandu Kukano, the prince of the Peko kingdom. May God bless you for bringing us together. And then this scenario that we have, make, let it be in our mind every time, every minute of the day. 
IPOP, one family, indigenous people of Biafra, one family. We must understand we are from the same parent and we must not be aside of each other. We must all work together in whatever we do in love. Let's not run too much fast on that on the on this on the on this speed the kilometer of sixty. Run on the other side, we'll be too forward, we'll be safe one run. When you carry your porch, they run that side. But we cannot run too much speed when you still be member the ground floor and you won't jump from ground floor, go become national coordinator, make you stay on our lane. Any lane when you find yourself, do it very well. Elohim, go bless us. And we are going to march home and go home. Me and you did this South Africa. You see the kind of name they call us here? How long do we want to be here? I don't want to be here any longer. I want to go back to my father's land, just like every other person. Mazim, Elohim, continue to bless you. And then let's wait and hear the result of uh, the winner this morning. All right. Thank you, my brother. I like as you do break up. Now, better broken language. Like they give me so. They take on, they do me for body. Come on. I want to say, man, I want to join you. You know, say, bros, I see the hot for studio here. I see the hot. And so with the area and they give our people, you no know, matter where you day, true, not true, lie, not lie. And we know they share you. We go break and give you. We don't care now. Now you they pay my house rent. I be now you they feed me. And hey, I go tell I true to now. At the end of the day, you yes, day your lane, I day my lane. I bet waiting day. Thank That's you very true. much, my brother. That's true. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you, man. All right. Thank you, indeed. So, of course, we welcome that. I see the hot. Now we just say, make we take small break, make we cool off because the thing, the thing don't rain for this studio here. And now only quarter. Now we want to pour ourselves this morning as we don't pour. We go come back again. Come finish for the thing where we don't start. My goodness me, this is Biafra Restoration, and of course, in Biafra Restoration, the truth must be told. In Biafra Restoration. I tell you, we must remain in the truth. At the end of the day, Biafra will come. The people of the East, my name is Mazi Kechukwanoha. Onule Kuro Hawan of Biafra land. That's correct. We are here to do the needful. We are here to speak, of course, the words of wisdom and the words of truth. You know, our leader cannot do it alone. We need to support him. And this is my own beat in supporting our leader. Now, the question is, what are you doing in your own side to support the struggle. What are you doing to support our Supreme Leader Mazen Nam the Kano? Because he have done so much and he needs and he can do rather with a bit of your help in your own area. It doesn't matter what you are doing. There is no effort. There is no contribution that is so small. I tell you my brother, even if your job is to preach the gospel, going on evangelism, that is a contribution that is far, far beyond any imagination. If you your own contribution is leadership. Be a good leader. Learn from our leader, Mazen Namdekano, because if you call yourself a leader and you are not learning from your highest command, your leadership, of course, is questionable. There is no how, no how your supreme leader will be doing it well and you under him cannot be able to, you know, photocopy exactly what your supreme leader is doing if you know you don't have that leadership capability my brother step aside let those who have what it takes to be leaders be the leaders don't try to push yourself into what is bigger than you that is why i keep on saying this morning that you must stay on your lane if you know what you can do do it if you don't know what you cannot do then of course go home and think about it don't rush to facebook don't be too quick to rush to social media and, and start embarrassing yourself and start making a fool out of yourself. Let me tell you, my name is Mazike Chukwonoha. If tomorrow I feel that I am tired, I am done with the struggle, I tell you what I would do because I am educated, I'm learned. I will go home and sit down and keep my mouth shut and keep quiet. I'll be watching from the sideline. Any day, won't want a Biafra. Ma join, no, because I'm a Biafra at the end of the day. I am not going to rush quickly to the social media because I am no longer a part of IPOB. Now I want to show people that you know what? But IPOB is this, IPOP is that, they are not doing it well, they are not. The question is, who the hell am I? What have I done to better what IPOB is doing? Absolutely nothing. You know, this small respect where I get, this small dignity where I get, which you could be okay, afforded me under the platform of IPOB, oh boy, and no one rubbish am. I know one rubbish because I tell you what, it takes only one minute for that respect and that dignity to do what rubbish. Because if you go on air and open your mouth, as one Zali Jua for Opialuchia Kambasia Bekahama, 
Wanzali Jua for Pialuchi, Akamba said Akahama. Unfortunately, I cannot translate this in English because Oji Imri Mios. Some people, because they, they, they were given some position in IPOB, because they gave you microphone, they gave you this and that, they gave you the platform, then you believe that you can come up on the platform and, and hallowed platform in our queen. You know, nonsense. There is no such thing like that. If you are given a platform in IPOB, it is not by merit. It is not because you are better than other people. I trust me when I tell you there are more people who can speak more eloquently than Maziki Chukwonoha in IPOB. I'm not talking in diaspora, I'm talking in Biafra land. People, when you give them this microphone, you will not even allow me to talk again because they are gifted. It is their talent. So when you are doing something in IPUB, don't think that you are the limited edition. It is just only you that if you go, nobody will be there. If anybody told you that number two, number two, the former number two in IPUB will be nobody today, that he will be on Facebook, that he will be on Facebook, he will only host 100 people, sometimes 90, 50 people on Facebook Live. Would you believe it? That is how people rubbish themselves. That is how people insult themselves. The small respect where they get, the small dignity where they get, instead of them to carry and pack for corner, they no go do so. They go just go there to come and show off their stupidity. So what am I saying in the essence? Stay on your, on your lane. Play your position. Don't overtake without indicators. If you must overtake, indicate so that we will know where you are going. If your car spoil, oh boy, pack well. Pack well for pack lane. Pack well for service lane. Open your boots, come out your tire, come out your jack. Open your bonnet, oh boy, check your car where, where. No waiting to do your car. No go carry car away, don't jagba jagba. No go carry car away, don't jaga jaga. Leave them for highway, they cause unnecessary traffic. Because we're a moving train, we are IPOB for goodness sake. You know, shoes are yakuri, yakuri, and one ne. If I want to lay the more woman's key to call her without indicating, my brother, I'm playing him guy, playing a lunch in a key, and with the motor garage, you're not going to call a motor car. My cog eating cup, cropal, absolutely that. They name it again, hey, can all right, stay on your lane, can you in America, Wanza? Can you in America, Wanza? The one way they give you, you don't even fit them. The one way they give you, you never show, say you are worthy of it. The Bible said that he who is capable to handle small things, he said better, bigger thing, go, go do what? Go add on top for the one way you don't get. Small way they give you, okay, you don't fit do anything. Now you want big one, and you go envy, jealous, envy and jealousy. What you need to do? All right, they say that a word is better for the wise. And of course, before we go, because our time for us to go is here, I'm going to tell you who is the winner, of course, for today's prize. And I'm going to give you the answers. Of course, this question was rolled over from Monday to Wednesday, just like the Lotto Jackpot. <laughs> it rolled over. We roll them over from Monday, come bring and come put for Wednesday because the question where we knock on for Monday, but the thing two more people don't forget them. We can't remove some. So make we do them suffering. Make we do them smooth too. Make our people get them now. Eh? At least. So, as we don't do them, come bring and softly. We in a question we ask be this. So. The first shot of the Nigerian Civil War was fired in 1967. Of course, that is a known fact. Now, here is the answer. I ask when I say which month and the date and of course the town. Now, here is the correct answer. The first shot of the Nigerian Civil War was fired in 1967, only on the 6th of July, 1967, in a place called Gakem, in a town called Begwara, local government area in Cross River. I know so many people called, they got it right, but you know as we did do, and the first person will get them right and I'm be the winner because we no go afford to give everybody a prize now. And the first person will get the answer correct and I'm be the winner. So one of our brother, of course, I'm not going to give out his number on air to uh, for security reasons. You know, we cannot give our people's number on air, but we are going to get through to him. His number stopped at 6859. His number stopped at 6859. And of course, like we told you earlier, that this question, of course, is limited to only those who are in Biafra land. They are the only one who are going to win this 
surprised. So our brother who called, you know what I'm trying to do? I'm trying to check and to make sure that he also is in Biafra land. Because if he is not in Biafra land, automatically he will be disqualified. And we will, of course, roll the prize over to a next winner. Because there's no way we are going to give prizes to those in diaspora. It is those in diaspora who are supposed, of course, to bring the prizes that we will give to those at home. We want to better the life of our people. We want to assist them. We don't say we don't go fit, solve every problem. But at least for data now, where then they used to listen to Radio Biafra? Make we do them so. All right, confirm the person. Uh, your number starts with 080816 and end with 6859. Your number starts with 0816 and of course it ended with uh, uh, 6859. We are going to contact you as soon as possible at the end of this program and your prize will be on its way. You have won yourself a recharge voucher because he's the first one. We're going to make it more. You know, of course, going forward it might be lesser, it might be higher depending on what we get, depending on the sponsor we get. But we are going to give you 1,000 Naira recharge uh, card voucher which you can convert of course to data to help you for one day, two day, three day, one week. It's something you know. Um, but if, as we get more sponsors, we will increase the prices. And I've told you if you want to sponsor us, please hit me up on Mike Biafra OB. I'm on Messenger. Mike Biafra OB that's my Facebook user. For the last time Mike Biafra OB. Let's see how we can help and better our people. Our brother in Spain, Ma Simon Ayalugo, he is the one who has sponsored this so far, and we thank him for his, you know, understanding, of course, concern about our people. So the answer is 6th of July 1967 in a town they call Gakhem, which is in Cross River State. That is where the first shot of the Nigerian beer from war was fired. So my brother, congratulations for winning the prize. Many more is coming. Tomorrow is another day and another prize will be won. So keep listening to Radio Biafra Sadeh. Keep listening to the people of the East who who knows you might be the next in line to win this prize and of course i want to thank you all for listening i want to thank beer friends all around the world for making this program a worthwhile this morning and of course i want to thank my boys who have followed me to the studio this morning i say thank you for your support as well and of course i want to say may god bless our leader Mazin nam the Kano. may god of course Begin to protect him wherever he is and of course give him wisdom and understanding. May God bless our men and women on the war front. Those I'm talking about is none other but ESN, of course Eastern Security Network. Those that keep it the gates of Biafra land. My name once again is Mazi Ike Chuku Onoha. And of course I am your servant this morning. And today of course rather all together we all shall see Biafra from me from here it is good afternoon and i will see you tomorrow again goodbye and god bless the united provinces of biafra land